Yo, yo, what is going on, snipers? It is Stock Sniper Mike, and I'm back again with another two minute drill. That's one full week of trading highlights in the span of about two minutes. And another hot week in the books. June has been blazing hot, not just in South Florida, but in the stock market. And so has July. I'm rocking my rent due shirt because it's freaking short squeeze Friday. And rent is always due around here. So you got to go make that money. This week, very good news came out of the United States. Inflation hit its lowest point in two years. So we are now finally starting to lower inflation after all those battles of rising interest rates and scares of a recession. It looks like things are finally starting to get a little better as the stock market continues to bounce. In Bitcoin news, it looks like we got another rally coming up. It's nice to see Bitcoin get another run. Bitcoin spiking all the way above 52-week highs and above 32,000. Nice to see the run after the big, big drop close to the 15,000s earlier in the year. Now we're getting this nice bounce, and the bounce came after XRP finally voted as not a security. So they were actually in the battle with the SEC for a long time, is whether or not they are a security. Right when the news came out that they weren't a security, Bitcoin spiked, Bitcoin stock spiked, XRP spiked about 30%. Excited to see if sector momentum continues into this new week. It's awesome when stock gets spikes. But it's even better when we get the sector momentum in spikes. That's usually where the stock snipers make most of their money. We also have big runners that happened like DMGGF spiking 40% on the day. We also have Coinbase finally getting back above $100 spiking up 25% plus on the day. You have BitW, B-I-T-W spiking 15% plus. GBTC making new 52 week highs up 10% plus. Tons of opportunity out there in the Bitcoin world, and we're here to help you take advantage of that. Hopefully the momentum continues into this next week and over the weekend. Speaking of Bitcoin, NFTs are finally up. Google Play announced that you were able to use NFTs and tokenized tokens inside the Google Play games now. So they that did ban that for a little bit. Now that is coming back. And we got huge spikes in NFTG, actually a 60% spike in one day, as well as TKAT, T-K-A-T, two NFT-related stocks that were able to spike. So the Bitcoin sector was buzzing this week. Getting away from Bitcoin a bit, Chipotle, ticker CMG, just announced that they are going to come out with a guac robot. So now they won't have to cut guac and make this avocado anymore. Seems to be something that was holding them back a bit, at least getting the employees a lot slower with those long ass lines that are in Chipotle. They call this robot the Autocado. So interesting to see what it's gonna do and how it plays out for the stock and hopefully make shorter lines in Chipotle. Sticking with bigger company news, Bank of America just got slapped with a fine, over $250 million fine, which isn't a big deal for these banks, but they came out with news that they were actually making fake accounts and also charging too much and late fees and other miscellaneous fees. Not cool if you're a Bank of America bank holder and you might know what I'm talking about, about those random miscellaneous fees that sometimes you have to call the Bank of America about. They are now getting in trouble for that. So unfortunate week for BAC, Bank of America. And last but certainly not least, our man Elon Musk is back in the news again. Last week, we talked about how Threads was competing with Twitter after Meta's owner, Mark Zuckerberg, said that he would possibly fight Elon Musk in a cage fight. Now we got more news coming out of Elon Musk's corner, and this news is about AI. AI has been a big, big thing in the new year. It's one of the biggest and hottest sector that's been going around in 2023. And Elon Musk announced that he actually is going to be able to create his own AI startup coming out soon called XAI. So be on the lookout for that. Usually when Elon starts something up, it disrupts the whole community and everything around it. So excited to see what exactly is going to happen there. We'll be keeping an eye on XAI and Elon Musk in the upcoming month. Now, there was a lot of information this week, so we went over two minutes, but this is good table talk for those of you guys that have nothing to talk about over the weekend. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Hit that subscribe button below. Leave a little comment. Say what you like. Make fun of us. Be cool about it. However you want to do, 
Let's get it. Let's get rich together. We'll see you back here next week for another two-minute drill. Enjoy your guys' weekends. Peace.